guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl clarita d and today i'm going to show you a little bit the little bit that i have on decoration on fall in my house not in the whole house just the living room because i have people today coming over for about ties of my grand of my two um god's childs one of them is Elvis and the other one is Sophia. So happy birthday, Sophia. Today is your birthday. I love you so much. Not only you turned five today, but also became my godchild. As well, um, Elvis Jr. became my godchild. I love you guys. Mwah! God bless you. So going back to the decorate fall decorations in the living room. I didn't do the dining room as well, although I shouldn't have included, but uh, my dining room is upside down. And the reason for this is because I've been working off a uh, SUV instead of a truck. My truck, last Sunday when we coming back home, uh, broke down 10 minutes from my house. Uh, transmission starts slipping and we put it through the warranty well this warranty company now wants me to pay basically half of the repair between labor and parts so now i'm having this little problem with this company even though i still paying for the truck i never miss a payment never and this warranty is allegedly covers transmission, mortar and transmission. Now they're telling me I have to pay half, basically half of the job, which comes up to around twenty five hundred to three grand. And that is if I found if I find a used transmission, not a rebuilt one, not a new one either. So we're in that right now in the middle of all this. I'm stuck. I was stuck at home for a couple days, not being able to work. Uh, I was a bit of a mess, really, trying to gather a ways to get to do some kind of job without a truck. Um, thank God there were a couple jobs that the customers got the cost the carpet and pad transported there, and I was able to do. Another one was a glue down, which he already have it on the job site. And I was thankful for that. I was grateful for that. I had to to say it to Cold Interiors. Thank you guys. Cold Interiors, Bill. Thank you so much. Ah, thank you. Thank you so much, Bill. Really. And thank you, Cold Interiors. Your company of Cold Interiors as well. They, they do an excellent job. They do all kind of jobs. Remodeling from tiling, uh, wood floors. Us, we doing the, the job of carpet, but they also do some kind of construction and they have to get the permits or whatever. They do that. They do everything. They do remediation, all that kind of stuff. So if you want more details on quality materials for the Cleveland area, Ohio area, let me down below a, a comment, please. Another thing is that I am... Um, since I'm stuck and I don't have that kind of cash, because I'm a small company, guys. I'm not a big company. I'm the owner of a very tiny, teeny, tiny. And I've been doing this for eight years, and you will say, eight years, you don't have a crew. I used to have a crew. I used to have up to three crews. The problem was that when it came, you know who, the COVID and all that stuff, everybody else went somewhere else to look for a job. And of course, once everything started getting back up again, but not everybody was willing to come back and work with us. Everybody finds something better. So, and um, the best thing is to wish them luck and send them their way. You know, they were good employees. They were bad employees. The good ones stay friends with us. The other ones are not so good. They just stop talking to us. So. It is what it is, and it's life, you know, I cannot. So you see, a little bit different, it's the office, but a different angle. Just, if you was wondering where the heck I am, I'm in my office, guys. The bed is that way. They usually see, and my desk is right behind me. 
around here some of my certifications some of notes that i put some for inspiring for me to keep going my laptop is open yes you see my daughter's face and my my own face when i was a little bit younger way much younger <laughs> i say she was in high school there and yeah so but here i am i'm 55 i can't believe it um so far thank god i'm truly grateful to live this life in any way the problems that i have also i'm, I'm grateful to it's I, i'm having a hard time but I'm, i will pull through in the name of god i will pull through i will do my best to try to get I already starting getting jobs again back up um some of the customers like i said i've been talking to them and they get them to to get um the material mostly the pad and carpet transfer transported once they get that transported ha, we can make it there with the suv we have borrowed from this my wonderful friends marco and gabby so the marco and gabby i gotta find their company name i'm sorry uh, mg pro that's their company name mg pro in the Cleveland area as well and um they uh loaned me their one of their cars and i am very grateful for all the help they gave me so so far i am working now and turn tomorrow monday i'll get back again and to try to get some other smaller jobs in with whatever we have and try to work on see if i can read thoroughly the contract and to find out something more about this if they specified what can i do if they don't do give the specifics on the contract then i'll i'll talk with them and either way i'm gonna have to talk with them and be more specific after all i've been paying for this extra warranty extended warranty well let's get to a haul i have a couple of pictures that i took one of them is where are you going upstairs i put a little tray with some leaves and that the leaves i got it from dollar tree this year the other tray with the stuff that is in it i got it last year and i have it somewhere else in the house so i thought it was perfect to put it over there and because i have something else in the other in the other dining room and the other table of the dining room and then i have as well my sofa my couch my love seat they both have each i'm gonna put pictures around here uh first i'm gonna put it around here about the stair the ledge of the stairs and i'm gonna put over here first of love seat and after i have to put the picture of the love seat you can see i'm gonna put another picture of the couch which you will see it has also but basically the same is one one um pillow or yeah one pillow and one throw um that pillow it was the same summer pillow i just put a cover on it so if you see it kind of flat it's because i have a cat i'm just kidding i'm just kidding it's just my better half love to lay down on those pillows even though I've been telling him for some time, those are for decoration, not for sleeping. And he still sleep on them. What can I do? What I can do is put them, get new ones when I have the money. Right now, I can't do. So, I'll do my best to put a little bit, something simple. Because I don't want them to get worn. I got a uh, little chair. Another pillow decoration pillow which is very pretty i put it over there for that and then that way i'll have um something else i have baby girl here in front of me and she's pushing against me to the back yes like you guys wouldn't believe okay nina i'm here i got you so um when the kids came over she was all happy and jumpy see she is nine years old and she's so happy with kids 
go figure. But that's her. She turns into a puppy when she sees kids or people that she loves. Yes. And you see that she click, click, click. That's her. So I'm sorry. She got me distracted. Okay. Back to the fall. Um, the equation. So I don't have much. Um, in front of the, say, the couch, as you've seen, I have a candle on top of some books of my coffee table. You turn off. Okay. Don't turn off. And, um, on top of my, uh, a capital, which I'm going to put the picture of the candle right here. And that candle, I got it from TJ Maxx. Oh my God. No, from Marshalls. Sorry. I got it from Marshalls, guys. Oh my God. It smells so, so good. So crispy. Apple crispy. Something like that is the name. But anyways, I have... Next week, I will show you a little bit more of decorations from the dining room. And I apologize. It's, this is going to be a short, sweet video. And, um... A short video so far but I got good news for the people who asked me to make a recipe of tamales the mother of my grandchildren knows how to make them so we I talked to her we're gonna make a video of how to make a recipe of tamales so stay tuned be watchful we're going to do a video. I don't know if it's going to be this next Sunday or the one Sunday up. Well, I post it. But as soon as I have a, couple, a day off or, or so, she's going to send me the list of the ingredients that I need to buy. I will buy the ingredients. Let her know so she can come over and we can film that in the kitchen downstairs. And have the... And have that video up and running uh, I'll say like in two two Sundays from now, okay? Well, this is going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Thank you for new subscribers. I have a couple more subscribers and we're getting we're really a little bit past the, the middle of 500. So I'll be happy if I get to 1,000. But right now, if I we can make it to 500, I'll be so happy so grateful and yes 500 there's gonna be a cream away what's gonna be i have no idea i have no idea but for sure for real it's gonna be i'm gonna make something nice it's gonna be a surprise so regardless guys thank you so much for the new subscriber thank you so much for inviting me to your homes for invitarme a sus casas ya voy a hacer la receta de tamales i'm gonna make the recipe of four tamales soon and uh thank you guys for letting me part be part of your your day i know i i splutter out some of my concerns while well, some of what's going on with my business but i feel that we since we're family you're not entitled to know a little bit of me too well here we go thank you so much take care of yourself take care of each other Bye-bye. Mm, mm, mm. Bye-bye.